An amide or or, also known as an acid amide, is a compound with the functional group RNE -O -X -N -R -R and R refer to H or organic groups. Most common are carboxamides organic amides N. Topic 1E CX Topic 1 but many other important types of amides are known including phosphoramides N 2E Topic PX 1 and many related formulas and sulfonamides E Topic SX 2. The term amide refers both to classes of compounds and to the functional group RNE -O -XNR within those compounds. Amide can also refer to the conjugate base of ammonia the anion H2N or of an organic amine an anion R2N For discussion of these, "...anionic amides", see alkali metal amides. Due to the dual use of the word amide, there is debate as to how to properly and unambiguously name the derived anions of amides in the first sense, i.e., deprotonated acylated amines, a few of which are commonly used as nonreactive counterions. The remainder of this article is about the carbonyl nitrogen sense of amide. Topic: <laughs> Structure and bonding. The simplest amides are derivatives of ammonia wherein one hydrogen atom has been replaced by an acyl group. The ensemble is generally represented as RC NH2 and is described as a primary amide. Closely related and even more numerous are secondary amides which can be derived from primary amines and have the formula RC NHR. Tertiary amides are commonly derived from secondary amines and have the general structure RC Amides are usually regarded as derivatives of carboxylic acids in which the hydroxyl group has been replaced by an amine or ammonia. The lone pair of electrons on the nitrogen is delocalized into the carbonyl, thus forming a partial double bond between N and the carbonyl carbon. Consequently, the nitrogen in amides is not pyramidal. It is estimated that acetamide is described by resonance structure A for 62% and by B for 28% which does not sum to 100% because there are additional resonance forms that are not depicted in the above figure. One final thing to note when looking at the bonds of an amide is that there is also a hydrogen bond present between the active groups hydrogen and nitrogen atoms. Nomenclature. In the usual nomenclature, one adds the term amide to the stem of the parent acid's name. For instance, the amide derived from acetic acid is named acetamide CH3CONH2. IUPAC recommends ethanamide, but this and related formal names are rarely encountered. When the amide is derived from a primary or secondary amine, the substituents on nitrogen are indicated first in the name. Thus, the amide formed from dimethylamine and acetic acid is N, N dimethylacetamide, CH3 Me2, where Me equals CH3. Usually, even this name is simplified to dimethylacetamide. Cyclic amides are called lactams, they are necessarily secondary or tertiary amides. Functional groups consisting of phosphorus monoxide NR2 and SO2 NR2 are phosphonamides and sulfonamides, respectively. Pronunciation equals Some chemists make a pronunciation distinction between the two, saying for the carbonyl nitrogen compound and listen for the anion. Others replace one of these with, while still others pronounce both, making them homonyms. Properties equals topic basicity compared to amines amides are very weak bases 
While the conjugate acid of an amine has a pKa of about 9.5, the conjugate acid of an amide has a pKa around 0.5. Therefore, amides don't have as clearly noticeable acid-base properties in water. This relative lack of basicity is explained by the electron-withdrawing nature of the carbonyl group where the lone pair of electrons on the nitrogen is delocalized by resonance. On the other hand, amides are much stronger bases than carboxylic acids, esters, aldehydes, and ketones their conjugate acids pKa's are between 6 and 10. It is estimated in silico that acetamide is represented by resonance structure A for 62% and by B for 28%. Resonance is largely prevented in the very strained quinuclidone. Because of the greater electronegativity of oxygen, the carbonyl C o is a stronger dipole than the NC dipole. The presence of a C equals O dipole and, to a lesser extent a NC dipole, allows amides to act as H bond acceptors. In primary and secondary amides, the presence of NH dipoles allows amides to function as H bond donors as well. Thus, amides can participate in hydrogen bonding with water and other protic solvents. The oxygen atom can accept hydrogen bonds from water, and the NH hydrogen atoms can donate H bonds. As a result of interactions such as these, the water solubility of amides is greater than that of corresponding hydrocarbons. The proton of a primary or secondary amide does not dissociate readily under normal conditions, its pKa is usually well above 15. Conversely, under extremely acidic conditions, the carbonyl oxygen can become protonated with a pKa of roughly 1. Solubility <inaudible> 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 The solubilities of amides and esters are roughly comparable. Typically amides are less soluble than comparable amines and carboxylic acids since these compounds can both donate and accept hydrogen bonds. Tertiary amides, with the important exception of N, N-dimethylformamide, exhibit low solubility in water. Characterization <laughs> 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 The presence of the functional group is generally easily established, at least in small molecules. They are the most common non-basic functional group. They can be distinguished from nitro and cyano groups by their IR spectra. Amides exhibit a moderately intense new CO band near 1650 cm-1. By 1 HNMR spectroscopy, CONHR signals occur at low fields. In X-ray crystallography, the carbon monoxide N-center together with the three immediately adjacent atoms characteristically define a plane. Applications and occurrence Amides are pervasive in nature and technology as structural materials. The amide linkage is easily formed, confers structural rigidity, and resists hydrolysis. Nylons are polyamides, as are the very resilient materials aramid, tuorin, and kevlar. Amide linkages constitute a defining molecular feature of proteins, the secondary structure of which is due in part to the hydrogen bonding abilities of amides. Amide linkages in a biochemical context are called peptide bonds when they occur in the main chain of a protein and isopeptide bonds when they occur to a side chain of the protein. Proteins can have structural roles, such as in hair or spider silk, but also nearly all enzymes are proteins. Low molecular weight amides, such as dimethylformamide -N -CH3 are common solvents. Many drugs are amides, including paracetamol, penicillin and LSD. Moreover, plant and alkalamides have a wide range of biological functionalities. Amide synthesis Many methods exist in amide synthesis. On paper, the simplest method for making amides is by coupling a carboxylic acid with an amine. In general this reaction is thermodynamically favorable, however it suffers from a high activation energy, largely due to the amine first deprotonating the carboxylic acid, which reduces its reactivity. As such the direct reaction often requires high temperatures. RCO2 H plus R NHRCO minus 2 plus R NH plus 2 RC O NR plus H2O. Many methods are known for driving the equilibrium to the right. 
For the most part these reactions involve «activating» the carboxylic acid by first converting it to a better electrophile, such as esters, acid chlorides or anhydrides Lumière-Barbier method. Conventional methods in peptide synthesis use coupling agents such as HATU, HOBT, or PIBOP. In recent years there has also been a surge in the development of boron reagents for amide bond formation, including catalytic use of 2-iodophenylboronic acid or MIBA, and trist-2,2,2-trifluoroethylborate. Other methods Dehydrogenative acylation of amines is catalyzed by organoruthenium complexes The reaction proceed by one dehydrogenation of the alcohol to the aldehyde followed by formation of a hemiaminal, which undergoes a second dehydrogenation to the amide. Elimination of water in the hemiaminal to the imine is not observed. Transamidation is typically very slow, but it is accelerated with Lewis acid and organometallic catalysts. RC -O -N -R 2 plus HNR 2 RC -O -N -R 2 plus HNR 2 primary amides RC -O -N -H 2 are more amenable to this reaction. <laughs> Amide reactions Amides undergo many chemical reactions, although they are less reactive than esters. Amides hydrolyze in hot alkali as well as in strong acidic conditions. Acidic conditions yield the carboxylic acid and the ammonium ion while basic hydrolysis yield the carboxylate ion and ammonia. Amides are also versatile precursors to many other functional groups. Electrophiles attack the carbonyl oxygen. This step often precedes hydrolysis, which is catalyzed by both Bronsted acids and Lewis acids. Enzymes, e.g. peptidases and artificial catalysts, are known to accelerate the hydrolysis reactions. See also Amidogen Amino radical Amidicity Metal amides <laughs>